during the regular season a four game winning streak would be impressive but Dick tonight it means your team was one game shy only one team will be on a five game winning streak after tonight's game between the Texas A&M Aggies and the Washington State Cougars this is where both teams wanted to be Dick let's not wait any longer to get this one started the Cougars might have a little trouble with these guys Dick keys to their success depends on what Hey, the keys to their success tonight are simple. Number one, don't let them get too many open looks from beyond the three-point line. Secondly, give your big men the ball. Let them attack from down low. Third, take care of the rock. No turnovers, baby. Turnovers only lead to easy scores the other way. Well, Dick, let's get this one started and see what happens. Pressure that basketball, help one another, communicate. He makes the block. Oh my goodness, that was unbelievable, baby. Pass down low, there's a drop. There's a nice block from behind, Dick. Yeah, that's good timing for the defense. Keeps the dribble as they set it up again. Number 34, fakes the shot. Fakes the shot. Gotta think right now, gotta focus defensively. Dump it inside. From way outside, he gets that one to fall. Dumps it in. Steal. Showing great patience as he waits for the reset of the offense. A high screen. Looking for contact. The layup. Trying to go inside. Good defensive stance there against the spin move. Well, the key is to beat him to the spot, and he did a great job. He anticipated that spin move. Perkins is fired up and ready to go. Hey, whether you win or lose, you shouldn't be afraid to show your emotions. I'll tell you, he missed the post guy. The post guy had the great angle, was locking on the box. Jump hook from the low post. Can't get the shot to drop. Keeps the dribble as they regroup. And the ball goes out of bounds. Patience by the dribbler being shown as the offense is reset. From the baseline, they'll bring it out on top. He takes the shot. Washington State are on a bit of a run. Let's see how long they can keep it on, Brad. On the dribble, gives it up. Goes up for two. Great play to take that to the basket. Gave it up. He got the steal. The pressure got to the ball handler. Lost some ball pressure. It was too much for him, and he lost possession. Bland handles the pass. He up fakes. Newton comes up with it. Look at speed. I tell you, man, there's nothing like having athleticism and quickness. They look to get it to the inside. They go inside and now back outside. I tell you, inside outside action always works. And a momentary look from three point land. Oh, and you can tell by the look on his face, he wasn't expecting the whistle on him. Wow, look at the facial expression. He says, Me? The Aggies have a three point shooter spotting up. Dickey's going to kick it back out there from down on the low block. I tell you, a post player has to be able to read what the defense gives you. The ball goes out of bounds. Standing ovation, you've got to love this reaction by the crowd. What emotion, what passion. The crowd appreciates their effort. They strip him in a basketball, got a little too fancy, too much mustard there. He squares up down on the low block. I tell you, teach your player to face up to get in triple threat position. You can drive, shoot, or you can pass.
He shoots from the angle. The Cougars have found a player who cannot seem to miss Dick. That is on fire. He makes a nice shot fake. Tries to get the D to bite. With a jump hook. I'll tell you, great job protecting the basketball, getting deep post position, and the jump hook is so effective. Trying to feed the low block. A lot of good things happen when you bring the ball down to the inside. They'd like to get it inside to the low block. Unable to so far. Nice job of packing it in defensively. Yeah, really doing a great job packing it in. Did a great job of anticipating that lateral pass. And our trifecta for the night. Aaron Andrews on the sideline. With Dick Vitale. I'm Brad Nessler. Nice to have you along with us. Trying to feed inside. The skip pass is picked off. Launches the three. Makes it. That's a 7 nothing run. Look at that spacing. Down in the low block. Trying to work inside. Up. Easy one. Pressure that basketball. Good job defensively. Hammers it down. the perimeter. Dickey really seems to be getting and has it rejected. Defense did a great job with that blocked shot. Way off target. Leaning in, trying to draw contact. They are heating up this building where they're shooting right now, Dick. The hits just keep coming, baby. On the outside, the shooting guard handles the feed. Shots off the mark. Going to move it around the perimeter for the bucket. What do you think, Dick? They need a timeout here, Brad. He's going nowhere. Ball well, well, stolen. It's going the other way. That's where it's going. Turnover City, baby. Got to eliminate those turnovers. Washington State have gotten themselves into a bit of a rhythm on offense, Dick. They're really on a nice run right here. Coming out of the timeout, I'd expect we're going to see more focused play on both sides. One would assume so. That spin move's not going to work against this defense. That's a no-no, baby. Defensive player beats him to the spot. Job. Poor job offensively. I'm coaching. He's sitting next to me as an assistant coach. <laughs> He's pounding the ball with a deck. Where's he going? I did a great job creating a good angle too. When he goes up and under, he seals off the defensive player. Takes away the pass. On the dribble, gives it up. Work the perimeter. Spacing so important. Get 15 to 17 feet apart. He's got to get rid of it. Work it inside, and he tries a drop step. Defensively, nice job. Oh, great job using his footwork defensively to beat him to the spot. That was nice. Cue the rewind button, boys. They work the perimeter. Steals a pass. Newton receives the pass. Little bump. Says, I like that. Now let's see if we can convert. Just play, son. Just play. Let your game do the taunting.
The Cougars will step to the line for the first time. Routine. Second shot is good. And there's a lazy pass. It's stolen away. Turnover. Will it turn into two the other way? Tough spot defensively in the post, but he got the steal. Wow, I could have made that steal. He telegraphed that. He was the Marconi guy. What a poor pass. Inside. Puts it up looking for contact. He puts it in with contact and all. For two, Washington State are on a run right here as of late, Dick. Yeah, they've started to put it together on offense. Can they keep it together, though? That is the question. Terrible execution on offense. Looking for the foul. Picks off the pass. There's a high screen. Perfectly executed. Gave it up. Reese receives the ball. Good job defensively. They just won't give him any openings. Pressure in the basketball. And a momentary look from three-point land. And draws the foul and gets the basket. He's into it. Win, baby. That's his name. I like that in the player. This is the team's first trip to the free throw line. He got it. The Cougars are one of the top teams in the country. They never have a night off. Hey, you've got to love this program. Year after year, they're among the elite. Maintaining that level of excellence is often taken for granted. This is what posters are made from. Jumps into the defender. Dick, they're ripping up the Nets tonight. Hey, they're definitely shooting the ball well tonight. Great execution by these boys. On the dribble, gives it up. Coach looks on, focused, a lot of intensity, a lot of emotion. They'll work it around the arc. They'd like to get it inside to the low block. Unable to so far. Nice job of packing it in defensively. Yeah, they're really doing a great job packing it in. Then a great job of anticipating that lateral pass. Shoots from left of the circle. They let him get into a rhythm. Has a nice look at the basket. He might be on his way to a career game, partner. Well, he will, Brad, if they don't get somebody on him in a hurry. Puts up the shot. He's good for another score. Heads in his face. Any time now, boys? Turn over 
City that will always really negate any offense. Goes in. Goes up for two. Great play to take that to the basket. Let's check in with Aaron Andrews and what she's got in store for us, Aaron. Well, Brad and Dick, how about this crowd? They're enjoying this close matchup, and there's nothing better than a close game during tournament time. Gave it up, way out on top, controlling the ball. for two and in and out. For the bucket, perfectly executed. Three. The Aggies have got to continue to get him the ball. They need to keep feeding him the ball. It's simple. around the perimeter had him in the post and didn't pass it in reverses it and now there's a whistle and a foul oh and you talk about a happy group of fans listen to this crap oh there's all kinds of people standing and cheering and going wacky he rejects it here they come now on a turnover jumps in great play to take that to the basket Working it around the perimeter from three-point range. The Cougars have a hot hand right now that's scoring for them at the moment. Brad, he's on fire. That spin move's not going to work against a defense I'll like that. Tell you, they did a great job scouting post play because they were really anticipating the spin. With a little baby hook. I tell you, the jump hook so effective, especially against a big post player. Very difficult to block that shot. Ball comes back out from the post. I tell you, Brad, you got to have a post player that anticipates and knows how to find the open man. Let's see if they can get a good shot this trip. Fakes the jumper. On the top of the circle, the Cougars have found a player who cannot seem to miss it. They need to keep feeding the ball. It's simple. Take some pride on the defensive end. He squares up down on the low block. I tell you, teach your player to face up. You get in triple threat position. You can drive, shoot, or you can pass. Didn't like what he saw in the post and reverses the ball. And he tries to spin away from the defender. I tell you, he's versatile in the post. He's got the spin move and a number of other activities. There's a bad pass right to the defender. They work the perimeter. He shoots from long range. Washington State are on a nice little run at the moment. Hey, they to keep pushing and seeing if they can force a timeout. From beyond the arc, the Aggies have got to continue to get him the ball. Brad, he's on fire. Excellent spacing. That's so important. He blocks the shot. Goes out of play. And now he's got a little something for the crowd. They're not going to like this. They're going to be offended. You've got that right, Brad.
Got a man in high post. Kicks it out. Shots there if he wants it. Fires away. Questionable shot selection there. Well, I can guarantee you that he's not the guy they want shooting the ball. Work it inside, and he tries a drop step. Defensively, nice shot. A great Swatted from behind. Never saw him coming, Brad. And the ball goes out of play. Got a high post flasher. Goes up for two. Ten seconds to put up a shot. Up and inside. Picked off. On the dribble, gives it up. He launches a three. Off the rim and no good. the outside they've left him completely alone tries for two perfectly executed he goes with a jump hook i tell you the jump hook so effective especially against a big post player very difficult to block that shot Working around the perimeter. The shot from the baseline. Washington State are putting together a pretty good run here. Execution's been the key, baby. For two. Great play to take that to the basket. it around the arc Dickey. and has it rejected defense did a great job with the block shot and the ball goes out of bounds from the top of the key way off target Looking for a good shot. Top of the circle, they're working around the perimeter. Pull up jumper from way out. Nice shot. Hey, one basket, Brad. If they can get some points here, the crowd will be extremely happy. There's the fake, and now they'll bring it up. Stolen away. A defensive stop will definitely get the fans out of their seats. Gave it up. Ball comes back out from the post. I tell you, Brad, you got to have a post player that it. With the rejection. He sinks another basket. What are they going to do with this guy, Dick? I don't know, Brad, but they better do it quickly. Picked out of the air. Two for one opportunity. Tries for two. Doesn't go. Momentary look from three-point land. He didn't have the good angle. They should have got it to him about a second earlier. He bangs it in for another score. And the hits just keep coming on, baby. Shot clock is dead. For the bucket, perfectly executed. Inside. He takes a three. He knocks down another bucket. This kid's got skills, Brad. Throws up the prayer. It's no good. The ball goes out of bounds. 
Nick, look at the number of points off turnovers. I tell you, getting baskets off turnovers is such a great, easy way to score, Brad. You want to maximize these opportunities as much as you can. At the half, the Aggies trail by five. Well, Dick, so far we've got a close one. Any play that sticks out to you as the highlight of the half? The threes were the key for me, Brad. In my books, this shot sparked morale more than anything. When you're hitting threes, everything else comes a lot easier. And now let's get ready for the start of the second half. Washington State is getting a lot of rebounds, Dick, in that first half. Hey, Brad, these boys gave a monstrous performance on the board. They were relentless in retrieving the rock. Let's go courtside. What do you got for us, Aaron? Well, Brad and Dick, as you can imagine, both coaches were very intense as I met with them at halftime. They said at this point, it all comes down to playing their game, having fun, and enjoying the moment. Guys? All right, thanks, Aaron. Pass down low. There's a drop step, and oh, good defense. I thought defense reacted and beat him to the spot. Very poor job with the drop step, very slow. Perkin picks up the foul. Second personal foul. And there's a look at the backcourt comparison, Dick. I tell you, Brad, you always want to know how the primary ball handlers are doing. Are they getting their team's quality shots, good opportunities? The team which takes care of these things usually is in a better position to win a game. Ferocious defense tonight, Dick. Hey, are you kidding me? They're making me nervous. Nice move with a face-up. I'll tell you one thing, Brad. I like guys that are versatile in that post. Facing up is a way to take advantage of three basic moves. He beats him to the punch defensively. What a terrific job. Footwork really excellent on a post play. come up with a steal and they do for two gets it to go looking for a good shot very soft defensively no pressure on a basketball and with that there's going to be some open jumpers if they don't pick up defensively Executes the baby hook. I tell you, didn't waste any time. He got the ball in the right position. And then what it does, it keeps the defensive player away from blocking a shot when you make that turn. He comes away with it. Goes up for two. Drops the bucket despite the harm. Working it around the perimeter. Now the kick out. Time to pick up the defense here now. Sweet looking shot. He is super. He really is. Lobs it inside. Picks off the lazy pass. On the outside. For the bucket. Basket falls despite the contact. In the paint. Dick, not a bad drop step, but it doesn't work for him. Ate just doesn't beat him to the basket. Not quick enough. And, a and has it rejected. Defense did a great job with that block shot. In the paint. Stolen ball. They run it up into transition. Goes up for two. Leans in. And he scores despite the hack. Defensively doing a great job down there, and he's winning that battle there. I think it's very essential that you establish post position by moving that offensive player out, and that's how he's winning that battle. Well, there's a turnover situation. I guess most notable, the number of points off turnover. Well, Mr. Nestler, that's why you want to take care of the basketball. You want to protect it. Turnovers will result in points being scored at the other end. That's one statistic which coaches always monitor. the perimeter tries for two 
He keeps the concentration off the contact for the score. Look at that spacing. Takes the pass in the paint for the deuce. Great play to take that to the basket. They'd like to get it inside to the low block. Unable to so far. Nice job of packing it in defensively. Yeah, they're really doing a great job packing it in. Did a great job of anticipating that lateral pass. Looking for a good shot. This crowd is unbelievable tonight. Oh, they're emotional. They're packed. They're jammed. You can't find an empty seat. You'll get the free ones. Hits the first. Makes them both. The Aggies are down by four. Somebody inside. Too physical. Full house. And a packed crowd, and they are into it tonight. I tell you, what emotion, what an edge for the home team. Here's a flash from the post up high. Got a coming. nice screen. The ball goes out of play. Oh, that's going to be a costly turnover. Day. I tell you, turnovers can absolutely destroy a team. Second count winding down. Picked out of the air. The power forward takes the feed. He gets that ball in the low block and immediately goes with a shot. I tell you, did a great job creating a good angle, too. When he goes up and under, he seals off the defensive play. On the dribble, gives it up. The shooting guard takes the pass. The Cougars have a hot hand right now that's scoring for them at the moment. They need to keep feeding the ball. It's simple. Robs him of the ball. Top of the circle, they work it around the perimeter. He gets another one to go. This is a shooting clinic, my friend. right here, Mr. Vitell. Flop City! I tell you one thing, absolutely a flop. No doubt, Mr. Nestle. Isolated on the outside. They work it around the arc, looking for the open jumper. Tries for two. He gets it to go. Intercepted! Cross court. He throws up the shot. They're lighting it up from the field right now, Dick. They're in a dangerous rhythm, my friend. Dangerous. Dangerous for the defense if they keep it up. In the paint. There's the trap. He looks for three. The Aggies defy a player who cannot seem to miss, Dick. That he's on fire. Controlling the ball. Strips the ball. He shoots from the top of the circle. Everything they throw up keeps hitting the target. NBM, nothing but nylon. The crowd really admires this young man. He's very popular, Brad. He has done some great things on the court, and the people really appreciate him for it. Steal. They're off into transition for the bucket. 
the lane. Pump fakes. And a momentary look from three-point land. He gets another shot off and in. Hey, this show's about to start, Brad. Didn't give it to him down low. Going the other way. For two. Perfectly executed. Moving it around the perimeter. Reverses the ball after having a guy in the post. Off the rim and no good. Runs him first, Dick, and then works behind. Yeah, he's playing from behind him because that tells me right there they don't respect him as an offensive player. And they made an error, obviously. But they don't have the great respect. So they're saying, you know what? Let him get the ball and let him try to beat us. Now they work it around the perimeter. Double team now, bad angle. And the ball goes out of play. Let's check in courtside with Aaron Andrews. Aaron? Brad and Dick, what a turn of events down here on the sidelines. The coaches and the players, they are feeling the heat, the message from the bench, defensive stops, and do it now. Trying to draw some contact. Colt makes the finger roll. Pulls the trigger. The Cougars have got to continue to get him the ball. They need to keep feeding him the ball. It's simple. There they come with a double team to stop it. And he'll kick it back outside. He shoots from the top of the circle. He nails it from downtown. Turnaround jumper. I tell you, what a nice turnaround jump shot. Soft as velvet, fading away, impossible to block. Trying to draw the foul. Looking for contact. He's money with the shot. The Cougars lead by 14. In the paint for two. Easy one. Let's take another look. it and the ball goes out of bounds oh that's going to be a costly turnover then i'll tell you turnovers can absolutely destroy a team gave it up intercepted looking for a good shot He was doing a great job pressuring the ball and decided to go for the steal. A questionable decision, though, on his part because it resulted in a foul. You see, that's what happens when you go for the steal. You end up with unnecessary personal fouls. He goes to the free throw line. Sinks it. it on the inside there's a tough shot and one he wanted that one baby he says you gotta foul me harder than that I like it when the team gets to the free throw line it shows that they're being aggressive the key is to get to the line early in the game and often. Ricky's working 
on that low block and that right hit. I'll tell you what, he's trying to deny the ball initially, but the defense really doesn't do a great job of sealing them off. They go inside and now back outside. I'll tell you, inside outside action always works. Makes it. Working it around the perimeter. Jumped in front to take it away. We're going to move it around the perimeter. He can't miss. Then he should match feeling the blast. Has it rejected? Defense did a great job with that block shot. Dick, not a bad drop step, but it doesn't work for him. Arte just doesn't beat him to the basket. Not quick enough, and a great reaction by the defensive post player. Picked off with a quarterback pass. Sets a screen for his teammate. Work it inside, and he tries a drop step. Defensively, nice job. Bob, great job using his footwork defensively to beat him to the spot. There's a double team, and has it rejected. Defense did a great job with the block shot. I love this guy hook, especially when you get great post position on the interior. On the dribble, gives it up. Taken away. The point guard with the ball. He unloads. Texas A&M is showing a bit of a run here. Things are going their way right now. Coming out of this timeout as play resumes. Boy, it's all elbows and shoulders down there, and I think the defense is winning, Dick. I tell you, doing a great job in post defense. A lot of people don't realize that is an area that has to be taught, and this kid has responded in a positive way. Goes with a baby hook. I tell you, didn't waste any time. He got the ball in the right position. And then what it does, it keeps the defensive player away from blocking the shot when you make that turn. Good defensive stance there against the spin move. Well, the key is to beat him to the spot, and he did it. And has it rejected. Defense did a great job with that blocked shot. Overplays on the pass, and he didn't get the steal. Oh, he's humiliating. Poor job defensively. Let's go to the third member of our broadcast team. Here's Aaron Andrews. Well, Brad and Dick, the coaching staff knew this would be a key heading into tonight's matchup. This is something they stressed during pregame, and it's something they're talking about on the benches right now. The message, get the ball inside. Guys, they're doing that. All right, thanks, Aaron. I'll tell you one thing. You better be able to establish post play because that gives you inside, outside action. Spin. I tell you, feel the defensive player on your hip going one way, you spin back the other way. Looking for a good shot. He takes the shot. He is just lighting it up, Dick. He's beating his man to the spot and hit the shots, Brad. And he'll kick it back outside. Shoots from the outside. The Cougars have a hot hand right now that's scoring for them at the moment. Daddy's on fire. Steals the pass. The 
shooting guard gets the ball. Nick, I think there's a mismatch in the post. Can we get him the ball, though? Oh, Wait, clinical man. drop step. I tell you, clinic 101 on how to utilize the drop step from the low post. The Cougars will have their fans going silly if they can get a stop here. Takes away the pass. Brad, this place will be deafening if they can score here. He takes the three. The Cougars have found a player who cannot seem to miss it. They need to keep feeding the ball. It's simple. Takes the pass in the paint. This whole team that's on the floor is quick. But so is the defense, and they do a nice job. He puts it up. The Aggies have got to continue to get him the ball. And he's on fire. Goes out of bounds. And that's one too many turnovers. Yeah, those turnovers are really a nightmare, especially when they need the layups. He shoots from outside, off the rim, and no good. They go inside and now back outside. I tell you, inside outside action always works. Great defense. Pushes it up. And has it rejected. Defense did a great job with that block shot. off the pass with a long bomb fires it Washington State are doing a nice job of pulling a solid run together here. they're really starting to put an offense gave it up he gives him the fake they'll work it around the arc Shoots it, goes in. I'll tell you, he missed the post guy. The post guy had the great angle, was locking on the box. They're working around the perimeter. And a momentary look from three point land. Picked out of the air. Gliding in for the jam. Sliding and gliding. Nobody rotated over. The defense moves so slowly. Timeout's called. Let's check in with Aaron Andrews. Well, guys, I'm sure the coaches are using this time to go over crucial end-of-game strategy. Now, often teams will dedicate parts of their practice to special situations and end-of-game strategy. Now's the time when that practice will pay off, guys. All right, Aaron, we're going to watch that the rest of the game. We're about ready to hit the floor. It's a five-point ball game. That's not a lot of points to be down with this much time, Brad. He shoots from the top of the key. Oh, yes! Now they work it around the perimeter. That spin move not successful, Dick. I did a great job on the defense not allowing them to make that turn. If they want a chance to win, they really need a bucket here. Excellent spacing. That's so important to a good offensive set. It's even more important to have talented guards like they have. Yeah, that helps. They move it into the front court. Isolated on the outside. They work it around the arc looking for the open jumper. Here he comes defensively on him on the low block, Dick. I tell you, three-quarter position, trying to deny, but then he does a great job of post position, of spreading his body and getting the ball. That's a matter of clock management, isn't it? 
Mr. Vitale, how about that State Farm drive of the game? Oh, Mr. Nestle, this one's superb. The ability to get close enough to the basket and then have the presence of mind to finish off the great play. Wow, what a play. And the clock stopped with a foul. As we take a look here at our backcourt production. Hey, Brad, I'll tell you one thing. Productivity from the backcourt is a must. You must initiate the offense, distribute the ball, and score. These are all things that you rely on your backcourt to do. That line is really being good to him tonight, Dick. That line's always good, Brad. These guys just have to make good use of it. Makes his second shot. They need to score here to turn this to a one-possession game. charity strike no rebounding that they're nailing the free ones tonight mr. Vital. hey this is where you win and lose games Brad hits his second they're shooting extremely well from the strike tonight Dick yeah they're making their coaches look good for making them shoot extra free throws every day the most out of that timeout, Dick. That makes it a four-point lead. These kids are here to fight, Brad. He hits a bullseye again. Hey, he's feeling it from everywhere, baby. Foul, and that stops the clock again. Well, Mr. Vitale, there's the foul situation so far. Hey, Brad, staying out of foul trouble, then a stretch of any game is vital. You want to keep your opponents off the free throw line and out of bonus situation. No problem so far at the free throw line tonight, Dick. Well, they're making the most of the free ones. Gets his second. They're making good use of their free throw opportunities tonight. Good free throw shooting teams seem to always give themselves a chance to win. He fires from long range. Rims out. Well, Dick, sometimes statistics lie, but in this tournament game, I don't think they do. The better team won, and they're going on. Well, I'll tell you, they won this game, Brad, when you look at it and analyze it, because they really had all the right people shoot the ball at the right moment. They did a terrific job offensively. Washington State completes a five-game winning streak with a big, big win today. I'll tell you one thing, the coach doesn't want five, baby. He wants the Super Six because the six means the national championship, and they're ready to win number six and win the NCAA championship. So for Dick Vitale and Aaron Andrews, I'm Brad Nessler saying so long.